you feel about the characters that I use in the video? Um, I like all of the characters in the video. Um, I like the way that Teo um, as, uh, gave Shakiri the power and the, the confidence to express himself, which of course was the uh, the aim behind the video, I think. And um, that's what made, it, made me develop a connection with the characters and find a really likable element within them all. So I did, yeah, I did like them all. Um, I feel like the characters um, successfully fulfilled their roles, especially how you had Shakiri was able to act well enough to portray the character he was meant to, and so did Teo at the same time, acting the comedic, sort of like godly fig figure towards him, and they did it successfully, so I feel like the characters were really well portrayed. The actors that played the, um, each character um, suited it very well. Um, I think yourself wearing the costume that you were wearing um, brought a strong comedic value to the um, music video which made it very easy to um, retain the attention of, of the audience. Um, I, I felt drawn in whenever, whenever you were on the screen. Um, and then Shakiri as well, I felt that with the music sort of genre and feel, um, I think Shakiri he fitted the role very, very well. I liked it when Tayo banged his walking stick on the floor and he teleported into the, into the telephone box and I liked it the way they edited the, the, the they edited it when Shakiri was changing in the in the JD shop. Oh, okay. I liked the characters when they were in the tunnel scene because everything was colourful and they were dan they were really good dancing. Do you feel you developed a connection with any of the characters? Yes, I feel I developed a really strong connection with Shakiri, obviously from the start, where we see him, you know, struggling, and you know, he's writing down in his diary and, and, and he throws it away. It's quite a powerful moment to see that in the video and then the transformation during to the end, where we see, where we see him as a more confident individual, is really nice. Um, I think I developed a, a sort of a stronger connection with yourself in the suit because of what you were wearing. Um, whenever sort of the, the white glaring suit came on screen, you felt drawing and attached. And um, I think it, whenever you came on, um, the audience were drawn in a little bit more, so you never lost their focus or attention throughout, throughout the video. I felt like I had a connection with Shakiri's character, especially to do with the whole when you feel weak about something, so like you're unable to do something, but then there's someone there. It's sort of like a role model, so someone uplifts you. And I've had that experience where I look up to someone and they make me they make me get the best out of myself. So. I feel connected with Shakiri because he was improving his confidence and you could even hear it in the score, in the song when I said express yourself. What is your opinion on the use of the dancers? Um, I really like the use of the dancers, of course, because I know that dancing is a way of expressing yourself. I, I, was, I was able to see that within the video, um, and, I, and I found it a really nice, uh, really nice aspect as well. It made me think that this this music video could be used to, for everyone because you know seeing loads of different people expressing themselves, um, it really it really drilled home the the aim behind the video. Um, I feel like the dancers played an important effect. Um, the first ones you saw was like I think the buskers, and it just made it that more added effect and more realistic but, and it just fitted with the tempo of the song as it's like dancey and also the tunnel effect was really good with the whole colour scheme and the dance just basically added a more effect and also it fitted in with the whole storyline of Shakiri becoming a better dancer so it kind of shows how the relationship between all the different dancers and Shakiri's character. I like the dancer which were used because they're they can move their bodies really well to wow. to dance. Hey, they made me want me to dance. Yeah, they did make want me to dance because the way they were dancing to the beat, I wanted to like join. Um, I think it worked very very well. Um, it, it it brought it all together at the end, and it um it provided some sort of performance element. Um, I know during there was the um dancers in. Is it Camden Town? Is that where it was? Yeah. Um, the dance in Camden Town, and it was used, it sort of showed a journey throughout as um, Shakiri was seeing everyone dance, and then he was dancing on his own, and then at the end he was dancing in a group, so it was almost like a progression um, into he was achieving what he wanted to.
What would you say was the most successful part of the video? Um, the most successful part of the video for me was definitely seeing that transformation in, Sh in Shakiri as someone who, who didn't have a lot of confidence at the start and towards the end where we actually see him dancing and we see him expressing himself like many people throughout the video itself. So I, I thought that was a very successful part in showing us that emotional journey with Shakiri. The tunnel scene. Why? I liked it because that was the that was the bit where everyone was dancing and they were clicking their fingers and the balloons came down and it was okay. colourful. Um, I think I might have I really liked the um I like the tunnel scene as it was very vibrant in colour and it was just very attractive to look at. But at the same time I really liked this the bit where um, the guy in the white suit had the cane and he slammed it on the floor and then they teleported and I thought that the editing in that was really really well and that was one of the key elements that I remember from the video that was done like very good. Um, I think the the use of the transition worked really really well, it was really smooth and really clever. The way um, you and Shakiri sort of vanished from the house and appeared in the phone box, um, I think that was my favourite bit purely because of the um, technology and the the time needed to be able to pull something like that off. What genre would you say this song fits to? Um, I would say that this song fits to the pop genre, maybe. You know, um, of course, that's that's a genre that a lot of people are exposed to. So I think um, I think that that would fit it quite nicely. Um, I would say it's quite dance pop, as it's very like upbeat and fast tempo. So yeah, I'll say it's the dance pop genre. Um, sort of modern pop and sort of music in the charts. Um, it's very much, um, it's got a steady beat that you can sort of, you dance to and you, you move to. Um, so that's, that's why I think it fits in that. Do you think the video represented the lyrics of the song well? Um, I think the video represented the lyrics of the song well. You know, I, I really liked, I really liked um, look, uh, the way that the lyrics were made into people. You know, when, when, uh, of course, when, when the lyrics are about him, uh, about him at the start, not being able to express himself. Um, I like the way that they brought that to life with, with, with the many different people that were using this video. Yeah, I mean, all throughout there was um, strong links with sort of um, sim symbolisation or representation of lyrics that were put on screen and that we could see. Um, so that that made it almost, from an audience perspective, um, it made us see that you've actually thought about what you're putting on screen to match the lyrics rather than just film a load of stuff and then just throw it on. Yes, I think at the start the narration was very to the lyrics, especially the fact that you had the character of Shakiri um, singing it as if it's him, but it was actually the other guy singing it. Um, I think, yeah, it sort of flowed well, the whole express yourself, so do what you like to do. Oh yeah, it does, express yourself. So I feel like, yeah, it did link with the lyrics a lot. What improvement would you like to see? Um, I thought the video was really good overall, but if I had to make one improvement, I'd probably say that maybe a bit of talking at the start of the video, um, just uh, you know, just some verbal communication to let us to, to let us know uh, even even more, um, you know, what Shakiri's problems are. Improvements. Um, there wasn't really much. I thought it was very very good, and it was well done. If the, no, I can't really think of anything. Um, I'd say at the end you should, you could have had um, a few more balloons um, it's for a bit of more of an effect. It just looked like um, you sort of ran out. But um, all in all, it was a very very good music video. But that's the only thing I'd change. Finally, how did this music video make you feel? Um, if anything, this music video made me feel really inspired. Um, it made me feel uh, confident. Um, and you know, enthusiastic, uh, to, and to want to express myself as well. I think it was a really nice video. I thought it was a really enjoyable video, and I'm I'm very pleased that I was able to see it. Thank you. They made me feel happy. It put a smile on my face. There was quite like funny moments, and it just made you like cheerful and enjoying it, and you flow well with it and stuff like that. So yeah, it was really good. Very upbeat and very sort of happy. It was um, not just the song, but what was shown on the screen. Um, sort of put put me in a good mood, and um, it it made me smile. Okay. Um, overall, how did the music video make you feel? The music video made me feel happy and joyful because 
the song was really summery. Like when you're in the summer, you just dance outside. Okay.